WJCL 22 News' is Lydia Blackstone joins us live now from the splash pad at Forsyth Park. What a great place to be on a day like today, Lydia. That's right, Greg. It's really hot out right here right now. The splash pad actually just turned down, so everybody's leaving now, but the kids that were playing out here were enjoying the heat. But if you were working today, today being the hottest day of the year so far, it was a little bit different. It's almost unbearable. These guys work in the morning. They'll break usually around 12 or 1 and then come back late in the afternoon. But on a day like today, you're probably looking at about 130 degrees surface temperature on that roof. Rusty Hunter and his crew at Roof Hunters are putting on a brand new roof on Tubby's Tank House in Thunderbolt. Tuesday marking the hottest day of the year so far on the inside of Tubby's manager Brooke Brennan says many people are opting to sit in their new dining room on the inside to beat the heat. You know, I feel like, you know, most of the people in Savannah are prepared for this weather. We I know we always are like, oh my gosh, it's so hot, but we go through this every year. It's just sometimes we forget about it through the winter and then it sneaks up on us and, you know, it is what it is, but, you know, it's it's beautiful out. Dr. Jay Goldstein at Memorial Health says there is an uptick in emergency room visits during these hot summer months. People just don't realize that they can't do the same things they're used to doing. Um, so we'll see a lot of heat exhaustion and the concern is when that heat exhaustion turns into heat stroke. And if you aren't able to stay out of the sun, Dr. Goldstein says the next important thing you can do is to hydrate. As you got to make sure cool fluids really hydrate yourself and it's not just water. You want to do balanced electrolyte fluids also. As for Rusty and his crew at Tubby's, while taking breaks and precautions, the heat doesn't stop them from getting the job done. The job definitely changes in the summertime. And Lydia, remind everyone as we're looking ahead to the holiday weekend that people need to hydrate, but they need to do it correctly. Yeah, so you don't want to hydrate with caffeine or alcohol because that's going to make you dehydrate a lot quicker. That's what the doctor tells me today. So hydrate with that water, with your liquid IVs, with your Pedialyte, and then with just a classic Gatorade. Greg? Lydia Blackstone with some important advice today and throughout the weekend. Thanks so very much. Let's